Right now, an update to our series, Race Matters, Policing by the Numbers. In our special report, we highlighted the racial disparities in court cases and how hundreds of people were entering pleas without really understanding the impact it would have on their ability to find a job or housing. But now, there's a major development in how cases are being handled across the county. Here's CBS4 investigator Jim DeFeedy. Would you mind telling me the charge? Uh, basically possession. Possession of marijuana? Yeah. For the first time in at least 30 years, assistant public defenders are working in the branch courthouses across Miami-Dade County. They are assisting individuals charged with misdemeanors, individuals who typically go to court without an attorney. Okay, so if you're not represented by an attorney and you would like some more information, please do not hesitate to you know, raise your hand and I would be glad to speak with you, okay? Miami-Dade public defender Carlos Martinez said the decision came in response to the CBS4 News series, Race Matters. It was striking to me when you did your report that you know a lot of us don't even look at the branch courts. The series showed the racial disparities of misdemeanor court cases and how hundreds of people every year were entering pleas without understanding the impact it could have on their ability to find a job, gain housing, apply for a student loan, or even enter the military. We cannot expect the judges to be doing the work of an attorney. They're prohibited from giving legal counsel. Starting in September, Martinez assigned a handful of attorneys to the branch courthouses, located in North Dade, Hialeah, Miami Beach, and here in South Dade. We're not getting huge numbers of cases, but we're at least providing information uh, to the folks so that at least they know the consequences they are facing. On a recent trip to the South Dade Courthouse, even Martinez found himself jumping in to help a few individuals. We just need to make sure that if someone is going to take a plea, which happens, that they're informed and that they're making the best decision for them. Assistant Public Defender Colin Hershey is one of the attorneys now assigned to South Dade. This is a great way to inform people, to give advice, to see if we can get appointed on cases and, you know, make a, make a real change here that it's not just one right after the other, get them in, get them out, but to say, you know, think about these decisions. Miami-Dade Public Defender Carlos Martinez says he plans on keeping his attorneys in these courtrooms through the end of the year and then evaluate how the program is going. Reporting from South Dade, I'm Jim DeFeedy, CBS4 News.